What's up, everybody? Potato here. Uh, bring oh, hit the fog button again. Uh, bringing you another little update video on the server. Uh, everything is up and running. Wow, the fog's really thick now. Oh well, it uh, adds a little bit of um, an ominous feeling, you know. It's like what's what's beyond that. Anyways, um, so uh, we have all the donators uh, written down as of right now, and I'll be adding them to the whitelist uh, pretty soon. And um, I'll be emailing them as well, so if you're one of the donators and you're watching this video, then um, you'll know that you'll be getting an email pretty soon, so uh, look for that if you haven't already uh, read it by the time this video comes out, which I haven't written them yet, so it'll be a while because <laughs> there's quite a few. Um, going to let you guys come on tomorrow, um, probably around 3, 3 or 3.30 p.m. Uh, Pacific time. Uh, mainly because I got stuff to do in the morning and I want um, when you guys are uh, when you guys all come on I want to make sure I can talk to you guys and, and, and let you know what's going on you guys know Catatonic Cat he's over here building his first little house on the server um, <laughs> he's been uh, he made it that skin himself with his uh, little flat cat ears so adorable um, we have uh, this new addition. I don't know who built it. I think it may have been Bunchy's uh, Campfire Lodge. Seems kind of stupid to me. I mean, big ass fire and a wood house, but whatever, you know. We have fire spread off, so uh, shouldn't be a much of a problem. Uh, we have very aquatic sheep and cows here as well. And there's also a boat out there. Uh, not sure why. Um, let's see. Can't, oh, look at that sheep. Just doesn't even care. It's not even care. Um, let's see, what else? Uh, there's this little building that I built just on a, uh, I don't know, a whim, I guess. There's nothing in it. Very boring. It's just, a, I guess, kind of a placeholder. If someone wants to take it over, then they can. Maybe expand it to a second floor or even make the inside a little bit bigger because it's kind of small in here you know I've, I made it more as like an underground type thing but um all right let's back up hello piggy uh let's see I also built this lodge over here and I don't have a road on this side yet I need to I need to put one in um we have lightstone in the lake too just because at night it makes it look uh, a little bit more interesting it's a nice cozy little cabin. Got a Minecraft picture, uh, Taj Mahal, I think, and uh, whatever that's supposed to be. And uh, my placeholder for a fireplace because at the time of building this, our fire spread wasn't wasn't I guess not working <laughs> properly. I mean, it was still spreading fire, and and when Bunchies came in, he lit it, and well, I lost the back half of the cabin, so. Uh, being a little bit more careful with fire now, as you should be. Uh, okay, so if we go over here, whoop, there we go. This is another little underground place that I was working on. Um, nothing too special. Uh, this was actually a coincidence. I was putting down um, carpet just to make it look, you know, a little bit more cozy inside of here, and I realized, hey, that kind of looks like a pea, and so I made black on the inside there, and well, I guess it's the potato chill out room or something. I don't know. So let's go on back up here. I've always been a fan of kind of building inside of like little mountains like this to where it doesn't look like a house until you see like a door and you're like, what? what? What's that? Uh, that's Bunchy's outhouse that he built before we did anything on the server, actually. I don't even know if you guys can see it in the other videos or if I don't think I've talked about it. It's just, it's like a one by one block inside of there. So, uh, this is uh, Puddle's place. Uh, there's a side door here. You guys have seen that. He added this dock in yesterday. Um, chickens. Uh, this is Bunchies and, um, oh, apparently it's called Taylor Tower. So Bunchy and Taylor both built this. Um, I'm assuming it's a little bit more furnished than it was beforehand, but it's too tall for me to go through and, and look at it all. Let's go down here. 
It's a little makeshift farm. Looks like someone has been harvesting some of the wheat because some of it's gone. Uh, what's the fastest way to get up here? Uh, Sniper Goo and Tyler's place. These are their towers over here. And they're not very easy to get to since they haven't built a road or, or some sort of stair system or anything. I'm not even sure if they want uh, people coming up here. It looks like this cow is trying to get through. And um, they're just going to have to deal with me busting this down because there we go. Cool little tower, some blue carpet, and another tower to kind of match. I mean, Sniper Goo didn't put the side uh, supporting things in, but Tyler did. And this is, I guess, their weird room of weirdness. I think it's more of just supposed to be a, a hangout room. Uh, Tyler has a tree inside of his, and I guess that's one way of getting down, or up here, rather. And he has stairs that go all the way up, and he has floors on each one of these, so he put a little bit more work in his than, than Sniper Goo did. Bunch of, bunch of, bunch of trees. Um, I'm going to go over here and try to mess with my fog. You can see it's just tons and tons and tons of trees. And, uh, oh, also something that I kind of wanted to bring up... Um, the server is based in uh, America, and I know a lot of you have kind of been asking me, you know, uh, you know, how well it will run for people overseas and stuff like that, and I cannot give you a definite answer. Um, I've talked to Vic Quixine a little bit about it, and he says that, you know, it shouldn't be much of a problem. They won't have the, the, the latency that we do in the States, which means, you know, there'll, there'll be a little bit, um, little bit of delay or lag or something like that, but it should be definitely bearable. Um, but you got to kind of expect that because, you know, I, I live in America. I'm not going to buy a, a, a server that's hosted in the UK, you know, cause why would I do that to myself? <laughs> but if things do go well, um, to the point where we can get enough overseas people to, uh, donate to their own server and I'll put a different manager over on that one. So I'll manage the one over in America, and we'll have another one overseas for all the people in the UK and Germany, and and um, I'm not even going to try to list more places over there. I just know those are the two biggest hitters. And uh, so, um, yeah, again, uh, if things go well, uh, we'll get a manager for a server over there, and uh, they can have their own server, and I'll go on there and hang out with them as well, and uh, I'll come on here and hang out with these people too. There's a torch here or something. You see that? It's like smoke coming out of the ground here. Would you look at that? What's down here? Oh, it's my basement. Motherfucker. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay. Well, uh, excuse my, my language, but that that's just funny. <laughs> anyways uh again all uh, donators need to look out for the email that they posted with their um application and i will be sending out an email fairly soon with the ventrilo information um server information again what time and stuff like that i know some of you like i said are in germany and the uk and probably won't be on during the time that i will be on explaining things so um I'm hoping that the other donators will explain to them if they're on when they come on. So, uh, that's about it. So, I'll see you guys. I'm probably going to work on a Let's Play tonight and release it tomorrow. And, um, because I know tomorrow is going to be somewhat of a busy day and I might not be able to record anything. So, uh, I'll see you guys for that, I guess. And I'm going to sit here and watch uh, Catatonic Cat build something fancy.